Hey guys, what's up? It's Crispy Banjo Kazooie. And hopefully, I have fixed the popping problem. I've changed my camera a little bit. Can't do the cross run yet. There we go. Yeah, everything's feeling much better, much better. Yeah, the popping's fixed. It's wonderful. I can roll around. I can do this thing. But yeah, Mumbo's Mountain. We're starting right now. Whoa. And we're there, and we warp in on this pad. Three new moves to learn in this world. Find my molehills, and I'll explain. Okay, cool. Kill this guy for being alive. How dare you, sir? Mmm, I'm sticking taste to health. Okay, so that's the health item in this game. These are notes. One of a hundred. I can't walk straight because I'm bad. Come on, jump up there. There you go. Uh, uh. Well, I can't do that. Oh well. Should have tried jumping back to shore, but... Oh, I failed. So. Man, walking around in slow-mo always... Always makes me forget how much... How often I use the other thing. Whoa, guy. That's a beehive. It gets all pissy, and it's like, well, bam It gives you three health. Every time. But later in the game, they become harder and, you know... Worth it, but less so. Oh! There's a monkey! We have to do stuff to his stuff. We have to be like, hit that. Hey! Asshole. Be cool. There you go. Make him do that. You can try to power power him, but it doesn't do anything. Just make him throw the oranges. Throw the orange. There you go. Outsmarted the monkey. Thank you, sir. One of ten of us on each world will help you progress through the witch's lair. Yes, we will. Bump, bump. There's a first one in the world. Good deal. A little counter. We literally leave. Go back to the thing. Yes. Yes, yes. Stealing this orange, cause you can. Bringing it over here, cause I can. That monkey wants an orange. Yeah, that's right. We could have talked to him first, but hey. He just wanted an orange. He was a hungry guy. There's the second one. <laughs> I suppose I should take a little more uh, time to actually go through and do the stuff. But, you know, the first level just goes so quick. Stuff to learn. Ancient ways of the egg. Perfect. We get our, our gun weapon. Hold Z. Okay, the C buttons are going to be interesting with my controls because I have to uh, use the bottom stick. 100 eggs in the backpack. Control stick to aim while you are crouching. Exciting! Ha 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 jokes. So we get some eggs to practice with along with the eggs that are on these ledges. But I'm going to go this way. Let's. What's over here? What's this? We got a skull! Mumbo token! Used for mumbo magic! We'll find out what that is later. Hey! It's a switch with that witch's face on it. Oh, I can't... wait. Why can't I pound? I thought I learned how to pound. Oh, I must not have learned how to pound yet. Huh! Could've swore that I learned how to do the ground pound. Oh, no way, I learned this thing. That's right. Um, yeah, spoilers, you learn how to ground pound later on. Yeah. There we go. Avoid the orange. Triple shot again. Avoid the orange. Avoid the orange. Kill the monkey. Bear Beat Congo, he gets all high voiced and sad about it. And then we get our third token. Or, uh, not token. You know, puzzle piece from over here. Bump, bump. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Hooray! Now we just run away from the onslaught of oranges and leave him alone, never to be seen again. We can't climb this hill, though. Yeah, they are slippy. It's It sucks. Teach you how to get up steep slopes. Well, right now, I need to get up here. Luckily, we can use this wood texture as stairs to get to places. 
That's a termite. Dead termite. Now we're at the place in the intro screen. And we'll kill you. Now I don't need any more health, so screw all that noise. Zabam. Hey, there's a door here. What's inside? Hey, ugly, no bears allowed. Okay, whatever. No bears allowed in here, but I'm in here, so let's explore. Go over here. Up. Oh, oh, we can't. We can't go there yet. Not quite. We need to know uh, whatever ability they're going to teach us to climb steep things. So, let's keep exploring. Can't jump on stuff, but luckily it didn't dam- Hey, whoa. Didn't damage us for trying, but it did damage us for messing up the roll. It happens. <laughs> I could have swore there was a way to center the camera on you in this game. Talentrot! Hey, that's the most useful thing in the game. It's also gonna bug the shit out of some of you. Because once you turn it on, you go faster, and it's the best way to get through the game. Um, wait. There it is. But you constantly make that noise. Yeah. But, I apologize, that's gonna be our primary mo method of motion for the game, because it's that much faster. And these levels are kind of big. So I kind of like to do that everywhere, no matter where I'm going. Because running with the bear, kind of slow. Kind of way slow. Kind of not worth my time. I can jump more often, but that just makes me go, woo! And skid, jump and skid, jump and skid. Okay, here we can move around normal. Who bam Oh, not who bam I pressed the wrong button to who bam keep thinking X is B, and uh, that's, that's not the way things go. Whoa, I did not need the camera to zoom in like that. Hey, there's the mole hole, and there's a giant skull that we're going to check out in a hot second, but I need to talk to Bubbles. Or Bottles. His name's Bottles. It's not Bubbles. Bubbles is better. He's, he's Bubbles from now on. Nest girl, you'll be using it a lot. Whatever. Nothing more I can teach you in this world! Cool, we don't have to talk to Bubbles anymore. So what he taught us was the slam. The slam is nice, the slam is good, it kills stuff. We usually use it to bust stuff open. You don't really get much of an opportunity to kill things with it. And obviously they want you to break all of these houses. They're just like, hey, these have notes on them and in them. So bust them. And I'm like, yes sir, game sir. Oh, someone's pissed off about their home. Arrow him in the face. No big deal. Bear and a bird, destroying your civilization. Pretty soon I'm gonna disgrace that totem in the middle, so... Hey, I got a free life. Just goes to show, kids. Destroy all in your path, and you will be rewarded. Twice we will be rewarded. That is the fifth... Fifth Jiggy so far this play. Now, let's go ahead and just disgrace some culture. Mumbo's totem pole! Feed us with nice blue stones. Oh, that's what they want, so we're not really disgracing them. We're, uh, we're honoring them. Which is also good, as long as it gives us what we need. Just shoot into the mouth. Gets progressively faster. That's what she said. There it goes. And camera shenanigans aside. We figured it out. Camera shenanigans are going to be weird sometimes because uh, my C buttons are on the stick. Oh no, I fucked up. Uh, I should have remembered that. Oh well. We'll have to come back for that one. Whoa. Excuse me, I need this uh, this eyeball. Thank you. <laughs> wonder if I can jump to that from here. Come on, get up top. I know you have it in you. There you go. Okay, so... Don't do that. Can I jump from here to there? With a running start! Not even close. Okay, cool. So yeah, I'll have to come back for that. What's in here? A sleeping man who we saw earlier. Oh wait, you guys didn't see him. I saw him because uh, I let it roll after I turned off the recording last time and he's He's part of the game over screen that plays when uh, you when you save and quit. 
Every time you save and quit, you lose, actually. It's weird. Best shaman in all of game. Okay, cool. Yes. Hut boy. That's not very nice. Oh, I'm, I don't have enough tokens. Huh, I thought I only needed three. Well, I need two more. So let's go find more skulls. Because he will not help you. Unless you have the goods. And we don't. Right now. We do not have the goods. I could have swore there was something back there, isn't there? Come on, game. Let me switch that camera up. Nope, there's nothing back there today. Okay. Let's transform and roll out. And see what we can scrounge up. What's over here? There's a there's a jiggy. Just uh, in the middle of nowhere. I'll take it. Thanks, game. You probably get that for learning how to do this, because this walk lets you learn how to do this. Collected enough notes to break the first note door. Hey, we haven't encountered note doors yet. Thanks for the spoilers, bottles. Bubbles. Um. Beatrice. I don't know. I'm just going to call you random names from now on, Scott. That's, that's what I'm doing. So, get all the notes from here. Should be everything on the hill. Other than this Jinjo that we... Sh oh, hey, we left a skull and a Jinjo behind. How rude of us. Hey, four or five. So, wheat. So, there's some stuff underneath here to get to. While we're at it. You can dive while mid-fall, which is kind of nice. It gets you down there faster. And you can slow swim for maneuverability. It all works out in the end. Look at that. That's beautiful. So, getting notes from underwater. Because I want that 100%, damn you. I will have it all, or nothing at all. The song was true. Ah, didn't make that jump at all. I could have swore there was a Jinjo down there. Nope. Nope, that's a plant. Don't want the plant. Don't care about it. Um, come on. Do the thing. There we go. I gotta get used to the stick being the C buttons. It's really weird. But now we can at least outrun this guy. So there's a thing we're missing. Where? Is, oh, there's the yellow guy. Perfect. Need that last skull. That last mumbo skull is somewhere, and I don't know where it is. We collected the one over by the monkey. Got the one at the start. The one up there, I believe. I'll recheck, but I could have swore we grabbed it. I'm coming, buddy. I'm coming. Just stop screaming for help. I know. I'm coming. There he is. That should be the ninth one. Music's being weird there. It'll do that. So, yeah. Only a few things left to find, but I need that skull. That is a number one numero uno priority. No, it's already gone. I already grabbed it. Oh, duh, it's over here. So I have to know this to get the skull. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. I remember now. Let's kill this ant. Oh, it's already gone. Okay, so. We know the trot. We get up here. Got the skull. Let's go further. Oh, we can't. It's too steep for even that. So, who wants to take a guess as to what the magic turns us into? Yeah, you're right. A dinosaur. Obviously. A small Tyrannosaurus Rex to ruin the uh, ruin everything for everyone. Yes. I have plenty, as in just enough tokens to do this. Because the level provided me with just the right amount. Yes, we are a tiny termite with yellow so shorts in the backpack. Change back when ready. Okay. Yeah, termite small. It's fine. You're, d you're doing good, buddy. It's got just what we need. Our, our woo is cute, but our speed is low. We'll be fine. We make a fantastic termite. So now we're going to invade the hill and see what we can get from the hill. Oh, I love the music in this game. Yep. Cool. Yep, now we can stick to damn near anything as long as it's, uh, you know, not completely vertical. 
Which isn't accurate, because uh, termites, pretty sure they can go up walls. There's our hundred notes. Yeah, you want my shorts, I know. That's fine. I feel your jealousy from here. All 100 notes in this world, well done. Thanks, Bottles. Bubbles. I keep calling you by your proper name now, and that's ruining my life. Oh, that's the other guy below. I was like, who is that? But yeah, up the hill we go. Cool. There's an exit on the top. It's the only way to reach this place. I'll take that. Free guy for scaling the summit. Good band. Check him out. And last one. Off the edge. Because there's no fall damage as a termite. While we're at it, let's get this thing. Which is just chilling on the side of the mountain. We'll have to come back for that last thing. Sad face. But, come back we will. Because I will have that container. So, now we can exit the level. And we're basically, like, we should be done, but I forgot that thing. Grunty's magic stops, stops you from taking the notes off the world. But we still have them somehow because of the plot. So it works out. Uh, this dude wants to fight me, and I'd rather not. I'm gonna climb Mumbo's Mountain. Uh, climb. Jump and climb. Oh, it's not there. Oh. We have to go back, but not yet. We have to go back as us. So if we try to leave as a termite, he warns you, like, oh man, it's not working. It's not working, dude. And if you just keep going, you change back automatically. You can't be bringing game-breaking stuff into other levels, after all. So what we're going to do is I'm going to pause the recording. Whoop. I'm going to barely avoid death. I'm going to pause the recording real quick, go back into Mumbo's Mountain, and I'll just cut back in when we're getting stuff that we missed. Cool? Cool. See you guys in a second. Whoa, we're over here now. And what's over here is that switch we couldn't get last time. Let's hit it. Let's miss it. But then let's hit it the second time. Whoa, it's that thing I was going for that I forgot that I didn't hit. Yeah, basically there's a switch, there's a grunty switch in every level. And it makes one thing appear, one jiggy, on the map. Cool? Cool. That's what happened. So, be right back again. Next, what you're supposed to do is uh, leave this last guy spinning. You can jump on his head. Steal yourself a thing. And last but not least... Last but not least, we get ourselves the thing. We just jump up the mountain and boom! Got the second thing from the lair. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now we can just leave the earth. Yeah, yeah, his dialog box is gonna freeze us, then Mumbo's is gonna pop up. Yeah, I know, I'm magic geek weak, and then it gets completely gone. So yeah, that's what happens there. I think next time, well, let's, uh, let's explore a little more. Let's find the next world entrance before we stop. I know it's up this thing that we couldn't come up about before, because we didn't know the Talon Trot, and now we do. Hey, Beatrice, what's up, bar? Note door sealed by Grunty with one of her powerful music spells. It's only 50 co it's only 50 notes though, dude. We got that handle. We got double that now. Number on the door is the strength of the spell. Cool, cool. At least this to break Grunty's magic, which we can handle. When you open the world door, baddies escape and roam once more. Good for you, Grunty. So, let's open this thing. Bam! Take a maestro bow, and in we go! That door was easy. Oh, hey, who is that now? Hello there, young ones. I'm Brintilda. Brintilda's nicer sister. Hey, she doesn't speak in rhyme. Wonderful. About time she was taught a lesson. I know all of Grunty's disgusting secrets. And I'll tell you three of them every time you find me. Remember them well, young ones, as they will help you avoid a fiery fate. I don't want to hear them right now. Thanks, though. So it looks like this is the place we're going next. Treasure Trove Cove, huh? To remove pieces 
that you have already put down, press the down C. Once the picture is complete, all the pixies are stuck there permanently. That's fine. I know where I want to be. Nice! We're going into a treasure box! Treasure Trove Cove. Where is that? Like, that don't look like it's anywhere near here. What is this? It's kind of grayed out. It's for later. Kazooie's Shock Jump Disc. Find me and I'll tell you how to use it. Well, next time, I'm gonna stop now because I want to keep the videos around 20, 19 to 20 minutes. Next time, we have a choice. We can go up the stairs, up this green thing, or we can go down the down the doom path down there. We'll see what the downstairs has in store for us. So yeah, it's Crispy, Banjo Kazooie, and um, I'm gonna save and quit right now. I'll see you guys next time.